Hi everyone, welcome to my channel Cook with Chandi. Today we are going to make a zucchini tart. First thing first, cut the crujet into batten shape. You can call it as a zucchini tart or scarpaccia or quiche. However you call it is very easy to make. This is so good as a breakfast, snack or as a canapé, even as a quick lunch. This goes really well. Cut the bell peppers. Today I'm using red and yellow peppers and cut them into slices. and I'm using the leeks as well. Actually, you can use whatever the vegetable left in your fridge. There's no specific vegetable, whatever you wish to put, you can drop it. That's how easy to make. And spring onion, that goes really nice. and some onion dice them and garlic also I'm using cherry tomatoes and as well as sun-dried tomatoes Cut the cherry tomato into pieces and set aside and slice the sun-dried tomato as well. Chop parsley and grate some parmesan. Now we are going to make the egg mixture. Get five eggs, double cream, and milk. Two spoons of plain flour, two spoons of parmesan, two spoons of salt, one spoon of pepper, one spoon of oregano. and blend them. Now we are going to sweat the vegetable. Get a pan heated with oil, add onion, garlic and crujet. Season with salt and pepper. Toss them until all the vegetable gets soft. Pepper and season. Especially when you cook vegetable, try to develop the seasoning flavors. So for that you have to season each time when you add vegetable. That's how you can balance the flavors. Now add leeks and continue cooking. Season again. Toast it and add sun-dried tomatoes. Spring onion and parsley also, I add some olives that gives a nice flavor to the dish. And final seasoning. And the last is tomatoes. Now our mixture is ready. So arrange it in a baking tray. Arrange it evenly.
and pour over the egg mixture. Sprinkle some parsley. and some parmesan as well now we are going to cook the tart in preheated oven for 25 minutes in 180 degrees look at that after 25 minutes is completely perfectly cooked now we are taking into cool Meantime, we'll prepare our mousse. Today I'm using avocado to make the mousse. When you make the avocado mousse, make sure to find a ripe avocado. That is very important when you make avocado mousse. Peel the skin off and chop them. Add avocado, double cream and some salt, also lemon juice. After blend them into a fine paste. Look at the avocado mousse, it's so creamy and so simple. That's what we are looking for. Thank you for watching my videos. If you haven't subscribed me yet, please don't forget to subscribe and press the bell button. You will never miss my videos again. Let's do the plating. Arrange the tart and pipe the avocado mousse on top. And the finally, look at the how it looks. And the finally drizzle some olive oil over. That's how I make my Sukini Karpasia. Thank you for watching once again. See you soon.